the worst question was one that I cited in my talking points memo. Roll the tape. <laughs> During these first 100 days, what has surprised you the most about this office, enchanted you the most about serving in this office, humbled you the most, and troubled you the most? Now, let me write this down. <laughs> did he actually say enchanted you the most? Did he, did he, did he actually say that word, enchanted? Yeah, uh, you know, we're saying this is the worst question, but it's really a fascinating question. In a, in a, uh, let me tell you why. I cannot picture any journalist asking Franklin Roosevelt if he was enchanted or Harry Truman. <laughs> I mean, he had a foul mouth if he was enchanted or, or <laughs> Dwight Eisenhower or even Kennedy or Nixon, because they were men of a different era. They were men of a John Wayne era. Today's men, a lot of men today, even men in powerful positions, especially men in journalism, they're softer. They're what a friend of mine calls NPR men. They want to know about your feelings, whether you're enchanted. You know, I mean, if I, if I did a piece about you, Bill, you know, like for my website or for a magazine, and I said, Bill, what is it that enchants you? You punch me in the head, you know? I don't it's know not, what that means. It's not that, a, I know what the enchanted it, forest but is, but I, I don't know what else. Yeah, but it, it's the kind of question that fits our metrosexual time.